Why would you boost your immunity? It's very important to keep boosting your immunity especially during COVID. Eating any of the food won't be enough to fight against disease. Eating right is a great start, and there are other things you can do to protect you and your family from the flu, cold, and other illnesses. Immunity boosting tips. First one is healthy diet. Diet must include citrus fruits. Citrus fruits rich in vitamin C that help to increase production of white blood cells which help you to fight against infection. Your body doesn't produce it or store it, so include this in your everyday diet to boost your immunity. Women need 75 mg of vitamin C per day and men need 90 mg per day. Avoid taking more than 2000 mg of vitamin C per day. Vitamin C will help you to recover from cold. Citrus fruits includes grapefruit, oranges, clementine, tangerines, lemons, limes, pomelo, mandarin, kumquat, maniola tangelo, sweetie, ugly. Red bell pepper. Bell pepper is rich in vitamin C and beta carotene. It will help to boost your immune system as well as maintain your skin. Beta carotene help to keep your eyes healthy. Broccoli. Broccoli is super rich in vitamins and minerals. It contain vitamin A, C and E as well as fiber and antioxidants. Broccoli is one of the most healthiest vegetable. Try to include in your everyday diet. Garlic. Including garlic in food means you are adding a little zinc to your food. It helps to fight against infection. Help to reduce the hardening of arteries. Helps in lowering blood pressure. Ginger. Ginger helps to decrease inflammation and reduce sore throat. It helps to reduce nausea and helps in lowering cholesterol. Spinach. Spinach also a rich source of vitamin C, beta carotene, and antioxidants. Yogurt. Yogurt help to boost your immunity and fight against disease. Use plain yogurt instead of flavored one. You can make it more delicious with fruits, nut, and honey. Yogurt is a rich source of vitamin D. Try to use yogurt fortified with vitamins. Almond. Almond helps to prevent and fight off cold. Almond is good source of vitamin E and C and also contains antioxidants and healthy fat. Adults need 15 mg of vitamin E every day. Sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds is full of nutrients. It contains vitamin B6 and E, magnesium, phosphorus and rich in selenium. Vitamin E is very essential for regulating and maintaining immune system. Avocados and green leafy vegetables are rich in vitamin E. Turmeric. Turmeric we use in most of the dishes. It has anti-inflammatory action and helps to treat osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. Turmeric help to boost your immune system and reduce exercise-related muscle damage. Green tea. Green tea is a powerful antioxidant and it helps to enhance immune function. Green tea is also a good source of the amino acid L-theanine. L-theanine helps in production of germ-fighting compounds in your T-cells. Papaya. Papaya is rich in vitamin C. You will get double amount of vitamin C than recommended from papaya.
It also has a digestive enzyme papain and anti-inflammatory effects. Papaya has potassium, magnesium and folate to maintain your overall health. Kiwi. Kiwi has loaded with essential nutrients such as folate, potassium, vitamin C and vitamin K. Shellfish. Shellfish such as carb, oysters, lobster, mussels contain zinc. Adult men needs 11 mg of zinc and women need 8 mg of zinc. But too much zinc can actually inhibit immune system function. Poultry. Including poultry in diet can help to lower inflammation and reduce the symptoms of cold. Chicken and turkey, is high in vitamin B6. Vitamin B6 plays a vital role in formation of new and healthy red blood cells. Stock or broth made by boiling chicken bones contains gelatin, chondroitin, and other nutrients helpful for gut healing and immunity. Second step to boost your immunity is hydration. Water is an essential component in our body, it support immune system. Minimum we need 8 glass of water, but it vary based on gender, age, your health, how much you are sweating and medication you are taking. Men need to drink more water than women, pregnant and breastfeeding women need more water than others, children add elderly people have less thirst. Third step to boost immunity is to, exercise regularly. Exercise in not only to build muscles. It helps to distress yourself and enhance your immunity by improving circulation. 30 minutes of moderate to vigorous exercise can strengthen your health and boost your immunity. Fourth step to boost your immunity is to, get adequate sleep. Sleep and immunity are closely related, so many changes is happening in your body when you are not awake, Annexion fighting molecules are generated while you sleep. If you are not getting enough sleep you are more prone to get sick after single exposure to viruses. Adults should have at least 7 to 8 hours of sleep. Fifth step to boost your immunity is, try to minimize stress. Stress in having a major impact on your health including your immune system. Stress will suppress your immune system and increase the chance of infection. So, try to minimize stress by practicing breathing exercises, yoga and meditation. Last step to boost your immunity is to stay up to date on recommended vaccines. Get vaccinated as per age recommendation. Vaccines will help your immune system to recognize and fight against certain diseases. Thanks for watching. Please do like, share and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the bell icon. If you have any suggestion or question please comment below. Have a great day.